Across the country, small businesses are failing every day, and Spokane is no different. Local restaurants say unless diners keep supporting them, more will close for good. The trend is happening across the United States. Yelp re recently released a study showing 16,000 restaurants nationwide have already closed permanently because of the pandemic. Katerina Krasafis has more on what we're seeing locally, all new at 5 o'clock. Crave here in downtown Spokane announced yesterday that they would be closing their doors indefinitely due to the pandemic. I spoke with other restaurants in town who say that they're fearful they won't be the last. 2020 was supposed to be a big year for many small businesses. In three short days in March, everything changed. Instead, Mark Starr, owner of David's Pizza, has spent his 26th year of business just trying to stay open. It seems like each week that goes by, there's a new regulation that you have to conform to. Last week, Governor Jay Inslee came out with new restrictions for restaurants in Washington. Under the current phase, parties of five or more that aren't sitting outside need to be living under the same roof. Customers can take off their masks to eat and drink, but will need to put them back on when ordering. There will also be no alcohol served after 10 p.m. That is going to even further impact their profitability. However, he says the restaurants have the least control in this situation. I think perhaps the biggest impact is to the public, and they have to be smarter about when they mask up. Don't just run off to Idaho. All right. We're already seeing that because of that, we're having some issues. Issues Chad White has also experienced firsthand. He's already had to close two of his restaurants due to the pandemic and doesn't want anyone else to be in the same boat. Businesses want to be around. They want to continue to serve you and um, and so continue to support them. For business owners like White and Star, it's support that keeps their livelihood afloat. If that means needing to wear a mask, you know, just kind of Put your differences aside for a minute and think about them. The business owners that I spoke with today are also part of the Spokane Hospitality Coalition. The coalition was created to help business owners around Spokane navigate all of these new changes during the pandemic. To learn more, just head to our website, kxly.com. In Spokane, Katerina Krasafis, 4 News Now.